Level 1, Lesson 9. In this lesson, <coughs> you're gonna hear me sing a song in Swedish, but it's actually a rewritten version of the English folk song Monday Morning. It was rewritten by the Swedish singer songwriter or folk singer, whatever you like, Cornelis Vresvik, and uh, released in 1966 under the title Balladen om Herr Fredrik Åkare och den söta fröken Cecilia Lind on an album called Grimager och Telegram and I'm not going to translate it. The song is in three quarters time signature and like many folk songs it just has a verse. It doesn't have a chorus or bridge or things like that. It has five verses and a verse is composed by four lines and we're gonna learn these lines separately before we put together the song. The song is also gonna give us the last of the eight basic chords, the D minor. And to do this, we need to do some transitions. We're going to learn the D minor by moving from an A minor to, to it. And to do this, you simply take an A minor. You then move the entire structure down one string, like that. And you slide the third finger to the third fret of the second string. And to go back, you just construct the A minor in your preferred way. Move structure down and slide the third finger to the third fret of the second string. So, you're going to get chord transitions in 50 and 60 BPM. We also need to work a little bit on moving from a D minor to a G. And it's done in a similar way as if you were moving from a D, ordinary D. You take the D minor and you keep the third finger where it is. 
you move the first finger and second finger and construct a G. Moving back, same thing, keep the third finger down and move the first finger to the first fret of the first string and the second finger to the second fret of the third string. Here comes the videos. We're now going to start working on the verse and as I said we're gonna learn the four lines separately and we're gonna learn it in the order the first line, third line, the second line and the fourth line. Why I do that, uh, there's a reason for it and I'll, I'll explain it when we, when we get there. Line one looks like this and uh, you start it off on a D minor and you're then going to move to an E and this is very similar like moving to an A minor only that the fingers end up one string above and after the E there's an A minor so you simply just move the structure down one string and to get to the D minor you move the structure yet one more and you slide the third finger to the third fret of the second string. You're going to get practicing videos in 60 and 90 BPM.
We're now going to practice line three. And why we do this before we do line two is because line three contains a chord transition, a simple version of a chord transition that also is in, in line two. And it's a chord transition that some, actually quite a few of my students find a bit awkward. And that is moving from a C to an E. And I think the problem is we are very used to, uh, after a C, restructuring the hand and getting the moving the index finger upwards and the other fingers downwards because we have done a lot of transitions like C to G. And uh, so um, what you get here is. First finger stays at the bottom, and you only restructure these two like that. So I often see this happening. So um, in line three, it is an, in a bit simpler context, and that's why we're going to do line three before line two. So here you go. We're now going to do line two, which is perhaps the most difficult one of them. And it looks like, th looks like this. You're going to move from a D minor and then to G. And then comes the C and the E. And remember to keep the first finger at the bottom. 60 and 90 BP.
Line 4 is uh, very similar to line 1, so I yeah, don't think you have a lot of problem doing this one. But play through it in 60 and 90. We're now going to put the four lines together to form the verse. I'm going to practice that in 60 and 90 BPM as well. And that makes us ready to <clears throat> start working on this song video. So if you take a look at the uh, song overview, you find that there's a verse A and a verse B. And the only difference between A and B is how long the uh, last A minor is going to ring. In verse A, it rings for two bars, and in verse uh, B, it rings for four bars. So, just give it a try. From the Luge, a strong spear of bars, full of and queen. Som var en av glas Där dansar Fredrik Åker Kynd i motkyn Med lilla fröken Cecilia Lind Hon dansar och blundar Som är 
precis vart han vill Han för och hon följer Så lätt som en vill Men säg vad förlåt mig Så säg ni här vill Säg vad det är för det Fredrik åker så Du doftar så gott Och du dansar så bra Du midja är smal Och barmen är trill Vad du är vacker Cecilia Lind Men dansen tog slut Och vart skulle de gå Vi bodde så nära varandra ändå Till slut kom de fram till Cecilias grill Nu vill jag bli kyst så Cecilia Ett hut på Fredrik åkare Han skäms gamla kar Cecilia Lind Är ju bara ett barn Ren som en blomma Sjuk som en hel Jag fyller snart sjutton Så Cecilia Cecilia